Sunday night marked the event that people all around the world were able to view. The Northern Colorado Astronomical Society hosted a viewing event out at Fossil Creek Reservoir in South Fork Collins. And we're out here with the Northern Colorado Astronomical Society showing people the wonders of the night sky. Well, the big draw tonight is the lunar eclipse. That's when the Earth comes between the sun and the moon, and it's going to block out the moon because the moon will be going in the Earth's shadow, but it doesn't entirely block it out because the Earth's atmosphere bends light around the Earth and keeps the planet or keeps the moon um, somewhat lit. It usually turns an orange or reddish color, so that's what we'll be looking for tonight. The moon's large appearance is due to it being in its perigee orbit, in which the moon is about a distance of 42,000 kilometers closer to the Earth. The next super blood moon will not happen again for another 18 years in 2033. However, keep your eyes skyward next March 23rd when the next lunar eclipse will happen. CTV News, Neil Denman.